hey friends welcome back to my channel today we're going to be making some peanut drops or peanut cake whichever one you know it as it's the same thing that's what we're going to be making today so if you're new on my channel please go ahead hit that red subscribe button and don't forget to turn on your notification bell that way you can be notified whenever we upload a new video so let's get into the video guys <music> So what's going to make this video super easy is the fact that my mom is using the peanut that is already roasted. So go over, search your cupboard and let's make some peanut drops. Um, we already went ahead and rinsed the peanuts off, rinse off the salt and now we're grating our ginger. So in this bowl we have a cup of water and a cup and a half of sugar depending on the amount that you're making and depending on how sweet you want your peanut drops to be and we're just gonna add our ginger and we have a pot already on the stove that we're gonna heat up and then we're gonna add our mixture So now we have the stove on medium heat and we're just going to add a teaspoon of nutmeg and a teaspoon of cinnamon and two teaspoons of vanilla. So now we're just going to combine everything and then add our peanut and after adding the peanut we're just going to make sure that the stove is on medium to high heat and we're going to constantly stir. So while the peanut is cooking, we're just going to constantly stir, making sure that the peanut is fully coated with the sugar mixture. And while the sugar is being caramelized, we don't want it to burn. So that's one of the reasons why we're stirring. We don't want the sugar to burn at the bottom. So we're just going to stir this and cook it until the sugar is almost dried out. So guys, I grew up in the rural part of Jamaica and whenever we're making coconut drops or peanut drops, we normally just go outside and cut off a branch from the banana tree, rinse it off and that is what we would put our peanut drops on. So what we're going to use today is the parchment paper and as you can see, the sugar is fully caramelized to the bottom of the pot and we're just going to use a spoon to scoop up our peanut to the size that we want. And you can use the ice cream scoop or whatever you want to use if you want to perfect it um, so that they have the same size but it doesn't really matter for me so we're just using the spoon to just scoop it up and drop it on there and like in a minute it's gonna be ready everything is gonna be ready and for those who want to make it the authentic way from scratch what you could do is just use a raw peanut put it in a dutch pot and parch it or throw it on a baking sheet put it in the oven and roast it then you'd have to strip off the red part and that's a lot of work so this is way way easier to just use the one that is already roasted and you know rinse out the salt if it's a salted one and just get to work and there you have it your peanut cake or peanut drops is ready just like that 
and it's really tasty with the ginger and the cinnamon the nutmeg everything is just tasty and delicious thank you guys so so much for watching don't forget to like comment share subscribe if you haven't subscribed as yet and please share this video with a friend all right stay safe wear a mask show some love and be kind to each other